people. I know the wind is really intense, so I'm sorry. I'm gonna keep this very short. Look at my face. I've been in South Africa for like five days and I'm already like hectically sunburned. So I'm here at Dalheim, the Dalheim vineyards. Hey, you boy! Look, I came to say hello! Hello, Bobby! Look at this view. Not that view. That view. Yeah. Yeah, that, that, okay, minus these bloody cars. Look at that one. Wow, hey, that should tell you a lot about where I am. Um, but yeah, look at, look at my view. Isn't it, isn't it just kind of amazing? It looks like a bloody postcard minus these bloody cars. But um, yeah, if you couldn't tell from those mountains, uh, yeah, I, I'm in Cape Town. <laughs> I'm in Stellenbosch and uh, we're going wine tasting. Look at me, hey, living my best Cape Townian life. Guys, I found my future house. Look how cute it is. Oh, the sun is in the way. Oh my gosh. Look at it. It's got ivy all over it. No, man. Oh, look who came to join us, eh? Hey? Whoopi, you come here. Come here. You coming to me? Oh, come here. Hello, Whoopi. Oh, you want to go? Okay. Okay, so this is the Pinotage Rosé. No, it's fine, I'll wait. Oh. No, it's fine, I'll wait. Oh, what do I need to do? <laughs> We're gonna cheer. <laughs> I didn't know it was Cheers to social media and being antisocial. It's nice. Yeah, it's yummy. Cheers. Oh, so fancy. Wow, guys, wow. Look at this. Bear in mind that we've just eaten lunch, so uh, this, this should be interesting. This looks like it came from Korea. What is that? I don't know. Hang on. Okay. Oh, I'm, I'm hanging. I'm hanging. I haven't tasted this one. What is the name of this one again? Sorry, I forget that I'm sitting with a wine connoisseur. You can tell me, shut up. No, no, it's okay. No, I just smell it. Nose it. I have to nose it first. Is that a wine tone? Yeah. What am I supposed to smell? <laughs> this is a skill that I don't have. Well, I smell a hint of um, yeah, citrus and gooseberries. And, and a hint of sake. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> now take a piece of cheese. I'm taking a piece of cheese. Nothing. I wish I could vlog your face. <laughs> no, it's good. Can you taste the difference? No. It's amazing what moving to Cape Town does to you. You like instantly become a wine connoisseur, which is what happened to some people. I wish I could show you their faces, but I can't. You'll just hear this annoying voice in the background. So figs and cheese. It's so <laughs> That's a much better picture. Oh, mm. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh. No. That, that's fixed. I'm not just a wine connoisseur. <laughs> the problem is I don't eat fruit. But you know what happened? It's because of all the bloody masala. Your palate is dead. Don't bring your racism to my rock. According to the olive connoisseur, these olives are not the same as pizza olives. And they're amazing. I didn't say they're amazing. No, you did. No, no, no. I said they're not bad. They're salty. It's definitely salty. Yes. It's not... I don't like it, but it's not bad. Your pets. Why did you bring your pets here? Excuse me. Um, it, I think it's one of your mango flies. <laughs> what is the name of this again? Dolomatis. You're a Dolomatis. This is so yummy. If it would just focus. 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 There we go. It's got like rice and spices and apparently almonds according to the almond connoisseur opposite me. Actually this leaf, this leaf tastes like like puri pata. This is what it is. Focus. 
on my spider screen. Oh my god. So she's trying to show us what this is, but forget about that. Look at her phone. Look at the state of her screen protector. I told her that a screen protector needs a screen protector. It's bowing its head in shame. Guys, this wine is 470 rand a bottle. I didn't even notice, but the wine connoisseur next to me noticed that we got a little bit less than usual. I forgot the name. Veracruz? Pinotage. Pinotage. Veracruz Pinotage. I'm just gonna act like I knew that all the time. I'm not a fan of red wine. Yeah. It's not bad. Yeah. I prefer the others. This is how the wine kind of drinks wine. Is it? Is it? Is it? Where's my finger? Show me. It's there. Let me put it on there. It's. This is how she's holding. Stop, stop lying. I'm not lying. Good morning, guys. I know the wind must be irritating, so I'm gonna keep this short. But I'm sitting at the waterfront. I'm having the, like the best Oreo smoothie I have ever tasted in my life. It's like mixed with coconut yogurt or something non-dairy coconut yogurt only in Cape Town would you find like non-dairy coconut what not yogurt honestly anyway it's amazing my friend just abandoned me because she has work and stuff can't relate yeah so I'm alone for the next three hours but uh, do you want to see my view for now let me just show you my view yeah that's my view look at that I mean what what the hell what 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 There's clearly like a school trip going on with some very excitable kids. Yeah, school trip again, can't relate because I'm on holiday. <laughs> Ooh, you know, those kids are getting shouted at. Mm -hmm. Ooh, oh, gosh. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go walk around for a bit and buy some unnecessary things because I can. I feel like such a tourist in my own country. But honestly, this is the thing about Cape Town. You always feel like a tourist even though this is your country. It's just... I know I always bash Cape Town and Cape Townians and that bloody table mountain over there. But no doubt, it is so beautiful. Like, I... I think when I retire, I want to settle here because like, what more do you need? It's like so cosmopolitan here and like you can just eat, find the most amazing food here and like Table Mountain, obviously. like two decades ago my parents took us to the scratch patch and it was basically just like this huge patch of gemstones and my sister and I were obsessed with these gemstones and we would beg our parents to buy these gemstones for us I don't know why I'm so out of breath here. 
It was like five steps. Anyway, I just want to go and see if this, these gemstones still exist. Guys, I just bought my way in. Oh my god. Let me try and find my favorite one. My favorite one was a tiger's eye. There's it here. This used to be my, oh, if it were just focus. focus on me. There we go. This used to be my favorite one. Don't ask me why. Like, this is the tiger's eye and it used to be my absolute favorite one. Basically, I had to buy one of these bags and that allowed me to enter. It was like 25 rand for a small one and 85 rand, I think, was the most expensive one. And then you get to come in and choose your gemstones. I'm suddenly remembering like how my eight-year-old self was like having an orgasm in this place. Well, not in this place. That would be gross. Also, I was eight. No, but you know what I mean? Just at the sight of this place. It was like my dream come true. I mean, look at it. There are gemstones everywhere. Even in these bloody mine carts. Look here. <gasps> Ta da! These are my gemstones! In, but uh, yeah, okay, I'll stop before Cape Townians get like an even bigger head as if their heads need to grow anymore, you know, Cape Townians here. Oh, also, I forgot like <sighs> these marketplaces you need to like pay not just with money but with like your arms and your legs and your vital organs. Like, I keep forgetting that this place is such a tourist trap. Dear Cape Town, please remember that uh, South Africans also live here. Hey, not just Americans and British people. We also want to buy stuff, but we are poor. So can you not make everything like over a thousand million gazillion rand? Please and thank you. I'm done now. I think we're gonna go to grab a bite. So I'll see you there. Like why can't I live here? Okay, see you at lunch. Okay, love you. Bye. That it is overflowing. This is chicken tikka masala. Well, no one really cares about that. A whole like pot of dal, and all of this came to 60 rand. That's crazy. Look at this massive shawarma. It looks like a roti. It's, just, it's exactly a roti. Yeah. And this was how much? Also 60 with a pile of chips. I'm so happy. So happy. We're gonna give this a taste. Look at all this gravy. Oh my gosh. Great. <laughs> Do not bring your whiteness here. It is gravy, not sauce. 
love it. But it has like a northern taste. Facing the door. Northern star. Yummy. And walk over like this. I'm just gonna go to them. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna go. What a bad here because the World Cup is basically people's actual private houses so I'm not gonna like speak a lot here and be rude and stupid so I'm just gonna show you the houses because they're so pretty and colorful they look like a house rainbow <laughs> God, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> God, you guys Hi. are friendly here, eh? Wee. <gasps> so pretty. I love the shadows here. Shadow. Just like look at. Wow. Look at this. Damn. No man, I'm saying, like in a line. Come here. Turn around. Can I flip this up so they can actually see? Oh. So, yeah, I can see your face. It's not fun. But hang on. Come back. Turn around. No, man. In line with the line. Oh. In any line with me. But I actually wanted you to turn around and then you walk towards the line. Turn your back to me. Okay. <laughs> and, then and then just go towards the line. Oh. Without dying. That, that's a better instruction. That's better. Okay, you got it? 
Yeah. Thank you. We have the same idea. <laughs> How's it guys? Look at this place. There's Table Mountain in the back there. And there's just, you know, the city down there. I'm here on Signal Hill. I know this wind is going to be bad. So I'm going to end the vlog here. Because I'm going home now. I'm going back to good old KZN now. Um, so yeah, this is the last bit of footage that I will show you. You know, all I hear is foreign accents. You, I don't hear any South African accents here. And I wonder what it's like to live in a city that's just got like this constant flow of tourists anyway look at cape town look at this look at this what so you've got like the mountain and the city in the background over there and then if i turn around you can't really see it but the sea is on that side like what the heck let's go by the sea Oh, there's the three sisters over there. The tampon towers? Wow, thanks for that. I don't know if I ever told you, but that's Table Mountain. <laughs> Look at that little mosque over there. I just love that little mosque. It's like tiny and in the middle of nowhere. You can't see the full mountain. What did you say? You can't see the full mountain. Because clearly you haven't had enough of the mountain yet. <laughs> Jesus. Oh hey, editing Sam here. It looks like uh, I've come to the end. Looks like I've come to the end of my Cape Town footage. Uh, trust me, this is just as surprising for me as it is for you. I remember I had every intention to go back to KZN and then film the end over there but when I went back to KZN, I immediately fell asleep in the car. But I do remember that when I got back, I met some subscribers at the airport. Um, because I'm such a great person, I obviously cannot remember your names. Um, but I remember you guys. Um, you guys were from New Zealand. Um, so if you're watching this, shout out to you. Thank you for saying hello. Uh, other than that... Cape Town was lovely. I had a great time. I still intend to retire there and have my babies there. Other than that, I hope you enjoyed that vlog. It took me about 157 years to edit that vlog. So I hope you watch that to the end, hey? Oh, you better, you better have watched that to the end. If you're not at this point in the video, you're dead to me. I'm joking. Kind of. Anyway, don't forget if you like the video, give it a like. If you didn't like the video, give it a like. Anyway, don't forget to follow me on all the social media, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you next time with a new video. Goodbye.